Who's that? Is that Joel? <laughs> you cheeky boy, say hello. Hello, welcome to my channel. If you're new here watching, I'm a mum of two. This is Joel, who is eight months adjusted, um, but he's 10 months. Been here 10 months, not long to his first birthday, is there? Um, and then I've got Ruben, who is six in a couple of weeks. So thank you for who subscribed recently. Thank you for sticking around. Um, hopefully I will gain some new subscribers over the next upcoming couple of months because I will be constantly uploading lots oh. of different things. Are <laughs> you going to say hi? Say hi! Say hi! So yeah, I've got Joel here, so he's not napping, so wish me luck with this, but I'm going to attempt it. Um, he's just had his lunch, that's why he's looking a bit of a mess. You had a nice lunch, didn't you? Yeah, he had peanut butter um, and on bread. Yes, you did. And he had watermelon, which he ate about half, and strawberries, didn't you? Mm. and some water yes you did um, it is school run time so it's nearly 3 o'clock but my partner's off today so he's gone to pick up Reuben he'll be due his nap in about 40 minutes so I'm going to let him go and play what he wants to play with um, and yeah I'm just basically today I'm going to discuss um, I'm got a shop it's basically online and it's called the pound shop i think it is or toys for a pound i'm gonna link um well i'm gonna add in this video in the just in the in the video basically i'm gonna just link it up here the shop so you can just type that in online so i'm looking absolutely awful today a lot of black under my eyes my hair's not looking good but there we go Excuse us behind you. It's not too bad, but I do need to clear up because I've made lunch. But I thought I'd just pop on here while I can before Ruben gets back from school because obviously a lot of this is for him as well and just get on with the video. So what I'm going to show you is basically all from there. They're really good stocking fillers and everything's pretty much pound. So if you are looking for cheap stocking fillers, I've only just found out about it this year and it's amazing. I'm going to also, when I get Joel's Christmas Eve box, before I start this video, these are the boys' Christmas Eve boxes. Um, I'll be sharing you where they're from. I'm just literally waiting for the other one. I did buy Joel one, and then I decided I wanted the same. Um, hello. So Joel's is going to be red, so that's Ruben's. Um and yeah, I'll be doing a video Christmas Eve box for a 10 month old and a an nearly six year old. Yeah. I've also, hopefully, I've bought a few little bits as well from Etsy. I've bought personalised reindeer candy cane holders. Hopefully they arrive. And I've also bought some personalised Christmas decorations. I can't wait to show you. So yeah, this video will be probably, hopefully, I'm aiming for it to be up in about two and a half weeks time, this one. So look out for that. But yeah, today I'm just gonna give you an idea. I thought I'd also show you Ruben's Christmas slack from Home Bargains. It's the Grinch, super, super cute. I think it was about eight pounds. He absolutely loves the Grinch. I also have found out they've got a Christmas box in there for 4 99 which has got plates and everything. So I'm gonna try and hunt down for that. So yeah, let's get on with the video. Um, right. What shall we start with? What are you doing? It's literally teething so badly and he's trying to eat me. Aren't you? You're trying to eat me. Um, okay. So, <laughs> cheeky boy. Should we get your little eggs out? Have a look at these. It's never easy filming with children, but we will do our best. Okay, so. The first thing I have got, 
this um which is a bust the toy out surprise toy in slime filled egg by ryan's world it's quite big again a pound to go in his stocking so really good these are for reuben this is a jurassic world light up i don't know if you can see that i think i can make it light up in there. there we go you can see that but it lights up it's basically a light up led ball there's free to collect i think it looks as if he's got the green one i don't know i'm sure it might be the green one you can't see which one you've got until you open it yeah he absolutely loves the jurassic world this was a pound so i thought this was really good you can't go wrong with that um then we have an out of space um, torch and projector. It's got 24 colour images and it's batteries included, which I thought was amazing these days. And that was a pound. That's um, another stocking filler. So that's super cute. It's just, yeah, I think it'd be interesting for him. It's got all these little um, 24 colour images. So yeah, I thought that was super cute, especially like when they're getting into space and planets and things like that. I don't know if you can see, but it's got all these images on the back. So that's that. See, that's for Reuben. Most of the things are for Reuben. Um, super Ninjas. I always buy him these. They always end up in the bin after a couple of days because they get covered in muck. <laughs> but this is a bargain, a pound for four. Now, I think I paid nearly three quid for two elf ones last year on ebay so kids love these don't they so yeah four of these what are you doing what is that um also these i'm I'll keep these separately also i got two packs of tubs of dough they've got a green a blue a yellow and a red and obviously these were a pound each but they're quite small they're not big but i figured that that would be good for reuben um and one for oh what are you doing and one for a present so yeah so we can't go wrong with play-doh i also picked up these they do a few quite a few cocoa melon bits they're just the Coco Melon Jumbo Pencils. As you can see, they've got quite a few colours in there. Um, and that is for a gift, literally. Perfect. A pound. Um, we then have got a Learn to Spell book, which has got 20 white clean worksheets with a pen, which I thought would be good for Reuben. Um, it says age four plus. So yeah, he always likes doing things like this. Um, what's wrong? Sorry, you're gonna have to expect the delays. Um, okay, so I've also got a cube, which is a fidget, which he wanted. It's only a small one, but it's basically glow in the dark, which I thought was quite cool. Again, that's a pound, so that's another stocking idea for a nearly six year old. This is what I bought for Joel and obviously Ruth will probably join in the fun. Magic Snow, something that sells out very quickly in the shops. Looks just like real snow. It spans up to a hundred times the size. So that was a pound. And I thought, well, that'd be perfect to stick in your stocking for them to have a little bit of messy play with on Christmas Day or Christmas Eve. You could even do it and you could put it in the Christmas Eve box. Next, I got... Um, this isn't actually from there, so I won't show that, to be honest. I'll keep to what I'm talking about. So this is a police vehicle. It's obviously just a cheap alternative to Lego. You can see that. It is for six plus and it's 20 pieces. So that's perfect a little thing he can do Christmas Day and build. Um, then we have 
this Paw Patrol pom pom picture. It's got hundreds of pom poms. It's five plus. It's got three picture cards because obviously pom poms are. You've got the risk of obviously them swallowing. I'm guessing. I mean, you could probably do it with a supervised younger kid, but that was a pound. Perfect stocking filler, little activity to do on Christmas Day if he gets bored. Um, then I picked up the cutest little gingerbread men. Now I've seen people selling these currently with like vinyl on them as like Christmas decorations or keepsakes or gifts. Um, but yeah, they, are, I think they're between about, I think they're about four pounds. Most people are selling them for personalized. Um, I personally bought these off here for a pound. It was a random color, which is a bit of a shame because they're purple. Um, and obviously I've got two boys. I would have preferred a different color. So bear that in mind when ordering. But it doesn't matter. Um, I'll probably, yeah, just hand them on the tree and then order a couple more next year in the hope that I get the colour I'd like. But yeah, they're super cute. They're so sweet. Definitely recommend these. Oh, teething baby. Um, next, I got this, which Vince thinks should be in his Christmas Eve box because it's something you do around Christmas make your own four festive figures a pound it's quite a big packet um you mix the plaster it's quite good and you set the molds and then you decorate the big figures by using the paints provided so i thought that was really good it's got um four paints a paintbrush and four festive molds so i thought that was really cute really cute little idea for you i'll probably Put that in the cupboard and see what I decide to do. And have a look at that. Um, right, let's get on to. Oh, hang on, a few more little bits. A Christmas projection torch, project, projector, sorry, torch. Um, it's got Santa the snowman, icicle, Christmas tree, Santa hat, a pound, obviously. That going is Christmas Eve box, you can't go wrong with that. Um, Obviously, the Christmas Eve box I will be featuring, but that will definitely be going in the Christmas Eve box. An elf money box, and he wanted one of these. It's not the biggest. I'll show you. Take it out of the box to give you an idea. Um, but it's super, super cute. It is cute, I must say. You could just use this as an ornament, I'll be honest. But, yeah, I'm really happy with it. What are you doing? So yeah, that. Also picked up these punch balloons. They've got a few different designs. This is a dinosaur one. Again, this is a great stocking filler with the key ring on it. I've got a red and a purple one. One for Gid, one's for Reuben. Then I got this. What boy doesn't like this? Well, a five-year-old. It's one of them whoopee things with where they make fart noises and you basically put your fingers in it so yeah that comes in a random color as well but mine come in blue so that's a stocking filler um what are you doing what are you doing this is a gift they do winnie the pooh like if you've got a young girl um or a young boy that's into winnie the pooh but this is for a girl it's a mega tap tap ball again so yeah, that was a pound. Well, that was really good. But also, you can obviously do this as cheap gifts. Fill up a little box, which I'll show you in a minute what I'm doing. And I'm sure you can probably find these in Poundland. But I thought I might as well order them on here because I'm going to get them sent and posted. These are the Elf paper chains. It's the first year I've bought these because I really want to do these with Reuben. And yeah... Perfect for decorations, necklace. Obviously, I can put some up in the boys' room. Do you want to see that? There you go. See, so yeah, I thought that'd be good. And this, I couldn't resist. I know how much he's going to love this. It's a die cast metal. There's 12 models as well. So you could probably order a couple and you'd hope they would put the same. Um, this is an elf. Yeah. Oh, look, there's all the different designs. So this one looks at the first design. The original elf with big ears on the road for elf special deliveries. Die cast metal. Yeah. 
there's not much more you can say about that really and um, what I'm going to do with this is this is going to basically when the elf arrives at the end of the month he's gonna be coming with this and also I bought some really cool cupcakes which I will put a picture here um, I put it on Facebook I'm sure you can probably find lots of cupcake companies doing them I paid four for ten pounds and it says like the elf one back and all that kind of thing but yeah there's lots of different designs really cool ones I actually like the sharp sign but yeah all the designs are on the back so yeah that's more of a oh, elf I'm back kind of gift you could do then the last elf thing I got was a self-standing oh, message board with the pen a pound I think again they probably sell these in Poundland or Home Bargains but I don't think they'll be a pound don't know how much they'll be but they might be slightly more or maybe in home bargains slightly less but it's quite good it's quite big um so yeah that is all that i got i'm just making sure he hasn't taken anything yeah that is all that i got from the um cheeky boy from this shop that i will show you the total cost was 32 pound for all that which is an absolute bargain. So everything in this video, £32. You cannot go wrong. Um, yeah, there's a few little extra bits that I will show you, which will be in my stocking Xmas Eve box haul. I picked up some bath spaghetti that I saw on Hayley Emma's channel. She recommended in Home Bargains. I'm gonna go back and get another one. My friend went back and they completely sold out of it. That is £1.79 in Home Bargains. Um, that's for Joel and I'm going to get Reuben one as well so yeah that's another little idea that's Joel's stocking um, oh oh and I'll let me go and get him oh you're okay you're okay have you have a bumpy again did you have a bumpy did you have a bumpy okay I'm going to go and get him okay he's just getting tired bless him aren't you do you want to see these? What's this? What's that? Nearly done. <laughs> oh, come on. Nearly done. Right. So, what we got next, Joel? Should we show them what we got? What we got? We got some bubbles. Bubbles. Yeah. So, I'll let him have that. We got. I got these in Tesco's. These are obviously not part of this shop. But, oh, I got some bubbles. They were 34p down from £1.50 for a massive bubbles. So I bought the boys both one each. That will just be for Christmas. Because um, you can never go wrong with bubbles, can you? Cheeky, 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 cheeky. You can never go wrong with bubbles. Um, what's this? Is this yours? Is that yours? Yeah? Can you sit next to mummy here? Right, sorry about this. We are nearly done. We are nearly done. He's done very well. Last thing I'm going to show you before I end this video is these super cute little boxes in Poundland. I picked up quite a few of these as gift boxes. And as I was saying, a couple of the bits I've got here for friends' kids. You literally just get a little box and just fill it up with a few little bits that, you know, cost a pound. Not much at all. So, yeah. Um, I'm going to end the haul here because he's getting a bit fussy um, but he's done well, bless him, considering he's teething and he's getting tired but I just wanted to do this video because obviously Ruben's at school and it's just not, it's hard to get time without him okay, well, I'm going to love you and leave you guys and deal with my fussy baby <laughs> um, please like and subscribe, comment down below and as I say, I will try and um, link the shop and everything in the video. Okay, thank you very much. Bye.